For the last 10 years or so, I've just been painting whatever I felt like painting. Art comes in so many forms nowadays, but the purest of them all is a paintbrush and a clean slate. And Palm Desert watercolor artist Robin St. Louis has 30 years of just that under her belt. When our oldest son, our oldest child, was old enough to go to like a community daycare for, you know, a couple of hours a day, um, I used to take him there and then I'd take an art class and that was like my big treat. Uh, and then it kind of just grew from there. But her artwork has turned into even more than she could have ever imagined. She now owns a puzzle company. I was looking for a puzzle for a friend as a gift. And so I started looking online at what was available. And I was kind of disappointed. I, I just, I was, I was surprised that there wasn't anything like fresh and new in puzzles. It seems like, it seemed like puzzles were kind of in a time warp. Like they looked like they'd always looked, like forever. So that was like, that, I just kind of filed that away. Thought, eh, you know, bummer. And then um, during COVID, we were doing a Zoom happy hour with some friends. And um, these friends of ours own a couple of my paintings. And he, he's a cardiologist actually at Eisenhower, his name is Dr. Coyle. He said, you know, every time I look at your paintings, I think they'd make good jigsaw puzzles. And I thought, huh, never thought of that. Cue Sunlit Studio Puzzles. I was excited to do something different with my, with my paintings. I kind of wanted to give them more of a life, you know, get them out there more in the world. Out into the world is right. One of her puzzles made it all the way to the state house in Juneau, Alaska. At the end of the state legislative session, I guess they always do one jigsaw puzzle together, all the staff. And there's my puzzle. So that was that was really gratifying to see, you know, just, and, then, and they're kind of going out all over, which is really fun. But just how do you get to the point of actually creating an entire puzzle company? Because that was the daunting part, right? When I thought, okay, I'm going to make jigsaw puzzles, but I don't know how to make jigsaw puzzles. So the first thing I did was I sent one of my paintings to one of those sites where you can be, you know, you can do your family reunion picture and it'll, they'll make a jigsaw puzzle out of it. And it came back and, you know, the quality on those is not great. It, it, but I thought we put it together and it was fun to put together. And so it was encouraging. Um, and so then I needed to find out how I was actually going to manufacture them. After searching through manufacturers and discovering there weren't all that many options, something clicked. I ended up having them manufactured in Korea. And that was actually kind of neat because our son lives in Korea and he speaks Korean, they were able to go to the factory and meet the people that were putting, that were manufacturing the puzzles. And, and it was just kind of a, a nice tie-in. And I had a lot of confidence, in, you know, in, in their manufacturing. Puzzle lovers near and far can get their hands on her lovely work. There are three places locally that are carrying them. Sunnylands gift, gift Shop, uh, Kitchen Kitchen in Indian Wells, and First Gallery in Rancher Mirage, and also online, which is www.sunlitstudiopuzzles.com. Besides the beauty of her art, Robin's profits will benefit young local artists. Um, I wanted to give. I wanted to give back. Um, I think arts education is really important. I, as you know, in a lot of places, it's been cut from school budgets. Um, I used to volunteer a lot teaching art locally in classrooms and stuff. So yeah, I wanted to give it back. Um, I'm not sure exactly which organizations yet, um, but at the year, at the end of the year, um, you know, I'll make a decision and, and um, it, it will probably be for art supplies and, 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 um, and teaching, so. With the support from her son, daughter, and husband, Sunlit Studio Puzzles is a business blossomed out of the pandemic. It gives me a thrill to think people will look that closely at my painting, you know, where they're thinking, okay, look at that, that color, that shape, you know, so that it's, it's, it's really, it's really kind of exciting for me.